OG coming through. OG coming through. All right, man, let's get right into it, man. GTA Online is here to stay, which shouldn't be a surprise to anybody. Let's keep it a stack. This shit ain't going nowhere. It's not dying no time soon, man. This game done made them so much motherfucking money. Why would they just abandon it? <laughs> I mean, let's be realistic here, man. They're not just going to abandon this shit. Sure, it's been milk for the past nine, ten years, but you know, as long as people continue to buy it, buy shark cards, I mean, hell, every time I boot up GTA Online, I see new players. I see level one through five squeakers beating into the fucking mic, acting a fool every time I get on that motherfucker. So best believe the, the player base ain't shrinking. <laughs> it ain't going nowhere. You know what I'm saying? And then not to mention, you know, you got people on 5M making servers and stuff like that. You know, Grand Theft Auto was always going to have the numbers it needs. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, um, what's good, though, about all of this is that GTA 6 is in development now. I don't expect to see GTA 6 until at least 2025. You know what I mean? My biggest question for the longest, are they making another GTA game? We wouldn't have known that had old boy from overseas not, you know, have hacked and leaked that bitch. Free that man. You know what I mean? So, by him doing that, we know that the next Grand Theft Auto game is underway. And, uh, you know, Rockstar said, you know, hey, it, 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 that, that leak ain't stopping shit. You know, development is business as usual and stuff like that. So that's good to know, you know, because Rockstar really, they ain't got to develop no other game, man. They ain't even got to do shit for real. And I know they're not in no rush to put out GTA 6. You know what I'm saying? Because, um, because shit, you know, GTA Online is doing so good. So fuck it, <laughs> you know, but my thing is, man, if you're going to continue to drop DLC for GTA Online at least fix up the city a little bit man like this mile high club construction in the motherfucking middle of the map like y'all need to do something about this shit man do something about it in free mode or something man like I know y'all got the motherfucking tools to you know clean that bitch up look what y'all did to the motherfucking Diamond Heist Casino man you know what I mean so they got they they, they got the motherfucking tools to clean that shit up it's just like they're kind of just letting it sit there for a little bit and you know I'm pretty sure nobody plays any missions starring that fucking mile high club construction site anymore you know what i'm saying so shit you know hell the modders done fixed the mile high club in 5m you know i, I i've literally seen 5m servers man where you know motherfuckers are literally play on the original san andreas map vice city you know what i'm saying it's like there's so much shit they can do hell liberty city gta 4 is liberty city map you know it, it's crazy what these niggas pull off on 5m man so it's like, okay, if y'all niggas can pull this off on 5M from your fucking home, y'all ain't in no goddamn uh 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 triple A developer studio. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got a motherfucking billion dollar budget and y'all motherfuckers are making it happen versus the developer. Like, come on, man. I mean, come on, man. But um but yeah, man, it's, it's crazy what the modders can pull off, man, with the limited tools that they do have. So it's like, yo, Rockstar Games, man, ball, ball in your court, my nigga. What, what's going on? What's happening? We ain't asking for much. We're not asking for much, man. I can't speak on everybody else, but you know what I'm saying? This little community right here, we ain't we ain't asking for much, man. You know what I mean? It's like, god damn, man. But um, what was I about to say? Then another thing, too, like, GTA Online pretty much set the standards for a lot of games nowadays. You know what I mean? You know, Fortnite kind of took it and run. What I'm talking about is like the DLC timeline, the you know what I'm saying, the updates and stuff like that, where they kind of change the game. At least Fortnite has the decency to change their map. GTA Online still looks the same exact fucking way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you got the Diamond Casino and stuff like that. You might see a couple of yachts offshore and stuff. Other than that, the map looks the fucking same, man. Ain't shit. Ain't really shit to the to the fucking map. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, a lot of games are doing this shit nowadays. Like Rainbow Six Siege is doing it. Rainbow Six Siege has been out for a minute. You know what I'm saying? Year one up there, year two, year three, year four. God damn it, it just keeps fucking going. Every game developer is doing that shit now, man. Hell, Call of Duty did that with Warzone. Here they go, about to start over with Warzone, uh, Warzone point, uh, 2.0. But yeah, I kind of figured GTA Online wasn't going to go nowhere because remember on the Newswire, you know, they posted a little goodbye message and stuff like that, but they didn't necessarily confirm that they were killing GTA Online. It was just kind of cryptic. It was just kind of something to get people talking or whatever. Rockstar Games is good at that. They're good at getting people to, you know, talk. You know what I'm saying? 
like these rumors and stuff will pop off and you know rockstar and them just sit there in silence they'll let niggas talk stuff like that they've been on that for the longest but yeah as i've said man unless rockstar games and them you know they, they, they tell you that out they mouth man just take it with a grain of salt bro that's it and then another reason why gta online is just killing it right now because there, there ain't nothing else to play there's no grand theft auto alternative out right now that could you know really fuck with gta online you know you got little titles on pc and stuff like that you know what i'm saying that you can play but nothing of the nothing on the caliber of you know gta 5 gta online not even fucking close you know what i'm saying so yeah that's another reason why this game is so successful and they know this shit you know what i'm saying this is just just an example of too big to fail at the moment you know what i mean sure rockstar might feel this 10 20 years from now the nasty work they've been doing but shit right now hey they they killing it right now there's nothing we can do about it but at the same time man it doesn't mean you gotta you know dump thousands in the fucking shark cards and stuff like that you know what i mean make your money worthwhile then you know buy my menu or something like that you know what i mean but you ain't hear it from me but um yeah man what do y'all think about all this shit i've said everything i had to say cutthroat ball out peace